Carol Larson, no stranger to politics, having served on the Avon Township Board as a trustee before she was out transgender. Her victory last night makes her the next Avon Township clerk, and she says one of her first goals to upgrade an outdated filing system. We have an amazingly accepting community in Lake County. Crystal Larson has made history in Haynesville. Transgender, she is the next Avon Township clerk, one of the state's first non-judicial trans candidates to be elected. Jill Rose Quinn out in Cook County just made this achievement back in November. So, I mean, we're both really new to this and we're part of, I think, less than 25 people nationwide. Crystal had already served in local office. Crystal has deep roots in the, in the community as, as a volunteer. So this is a person that is of the community. And uh, that makes uh, that makes all the difference. Anise Parker, a three term mayor of Houston and the president of the LGBTQ Victory Fund, says Larson's win happened because Lake County voters elected someone they know is connected to their community. For a lot of voters, there's almost a dialogue that goes on. It's something like, I don't understand that or I don't approve of that. But if you will be honest with me about your sexual orientation or your gender identity, I bet you'll be honest with me about other things as well. And that's what I want. I want people who will tell me the truth in office. Crystal Larson gets that as she delivers this message to the people who elected her. I want you to hold me to the highest standard you can. Keep me accountable. Be at those meetings and call me out when I'm not doing the right job, please. Larson says she wants the judge who presided over her name change to give her the oath of office next month. She remembers his words that day saying, quote, I want to be the first to welcome you to the world. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.